hello everyone welcome to our channel and today we will see how we can connect google analytics to google tag manager so for that you need to open up google tag manager and google analytics as well so first of all go to google tag manager and over here you need to make sure that you have added these tags to your website on every page it should be there so for headings it should be this and for body it is this this one so just copy and paste these tags for your website and in order to check it just click on preview and this is how it will appear then add your website url over here click on connect in order to connect your website to google tag manager basically it will connect tag assistant to your website so after doing this go to google analytics and over here for this video let's create a new account and after that provide the name you can put any name over here let me type it as htm for now then click on next after that provide property name it could be anything like htm2 and then click on next here you need to provide your reporting time zone of for you to receive the reports you can provide your time zone over here and the currency just choose it according to your needs and requirements and after that click on next and over here it would ask you to provide the industry category of you uh, let me select art and entertainment for this video and over here just the size of your business then click on next after that you need to provide the objectives of your business you can choose more than one also over here so just choose it accordingly and click on create after that you would have to connect a platform to start collecting your data from so it is a website i'm assuming you can choose android app or ios app also let's choose the website for now then provide the url of your website over here And in the stream name, I'm going to put this similar one and then click on create a stream. And over here, you can see that data collection isn't active for our website. So for that, we will require this measurement ID from Google Analytics. So copy this one and head up to Google Tag Manager. And over here, when you click on the section called tags, you will find the section called new on the right hand side. Just click on it and then provide the name for this particular tag like Google Analytics 4. And after that, click on tag configuration. Over here, you can select GA4 configuration. Now, for this measurement ID, this is where we will require Google Analytics measurement ID. Just copy it and paste it over here. And then in order to get it started, we need to trigger the events. And it should be for all pages. And that's why in the first or the beginning step of this video, I just told you to get the Google Tag Managers added on your website on every single page. After that, you would be getting the analytics for every page and then click on save and then click on submit. Click publish after that. Click continue. And this is how you do it. And in order to monitor the real time data, head up to Google Analytics. Over here, you will find the section called report click over here then click on real time now you will be able to see all the data updated over here if everything goes quite well as shown in this video you would be able to see one or two as per your website's data and this is how you connect google analytics with google tag manager and i hope this video was helpful make sure to hit that like button and also subscribe to our channel for more helpful videos